Hey, what's up? This is Learn English with Shane. This is the bathroom. So we're gonna learn some bathroom vocabulary words. First things first. Toothpaste. Toothpaste. So toothpaste is something, of course, you to brush your teeth. Get your toothbrush. Toothbrush. Use that to brush your teeth. Got a razor. Razor. So I use this to shave, obviously. Haven't shaved in a while. Deodorant. Deodorant. This is something um, you need to use to be uh, have good hygiene. Um, shaving cream. Shaving cream. So this is something to put on after you shave, prevent any aftershave burn. And this, whoops. This is a, uh, a beard trimmer. See right here. So I got it. Uh, I got it plugged in. Beard trimmer. Um, also, this is cologne. Cologne. I use this when I go on a hot day with my wife. This is hairspray. Hairspray. So I use that to, of course, keep your hair in place. Shaving cream. Shaving cream. Okay. Again, I don't shave too much right here. A little bit right here. Shaving cream. This is. Listerine or um, mouth pressure, mouth pressure. You know, it's a good thing to use in the morning to prevent bad breath, stinky breath. Soap, soap. You to wash your hands. Okay, and then after that, I have a towel here. Towel. Use that to dry your hands after you're done washing your hands. And uh, also, I have uh, contacts. Contact lenses, contact lenses. So contact lenses, you know, are good um, to put in so you can crack your vision so you can see better. Okay, um, come look over here. We have a shower, shower. So of course you have a, uh, a shower knob, shower knob, and you can um, you know adjust that to to the temperature and the pressure of the water that you want. Um, in there you have uh, shampoo, right here, shampoo, shampoo, wash your hair, and uh, also, I don't see my body wash here, um, here's some soap, soap, of course you, uh, you're going to wash your hands with, um, I do have some body wash right here, pull that out, body wash is really good to wash your body, you know, yourself, be fresh and clean, so you don't be stinky and no one wants to, to be around you. Oh, okay. And, so moving on, this is a bathtub, right? Uh, a lot of times people don't use bathtubs very much anymore. A lot of times what people want to use them for is just to maybe, you know, help their aching muscles and relax and, and put some candles and, uh, you know, feel really good, maybe do a bubble bath, right? So, um, of course, I'm sure you can see these lovely candles that will make bath time very romantic and uh, very lovely. So, check it out, Crown and Crest Candles. You won't be disappointed. And, over here, of course, you have your bath towel. That's a, a towel rack. Towel rack. Good place to put your, uh, your towels. Another thing, you got a bath hat, okay? Ladies like to wear a bath hat so they don't get their hair all wet, you know? Maybe they don't want to wash their hair every single day. Let their hair be strong and grow, grow nice. Uh, over in the corner we have the toilet. Not the most glamorous thing in the bathroom, but very necessary. So, um, uh, there's the toilet. I'll have to play that. Um, there you have a trash can right there. Toilet paper, toilet paper. You have the, it's a toilet paper roll. Okay. Um, moving on. This would be called a drawer. Okay. A drawer. Drawer is where you can put all your, your bath items in. And um, if you look a little further, over here you have the lights, the bathroom lights. Okay. Bathroom lights. Uh, help you to be able to see everything clearly. 
So, uh, you know, if your hair is all out of place and, you know, you, you, uh, you know, have something on your face, you need to get it off, toothpaste all over your mouth, wipe it off. You have a mirror, mirror, okay? That's where you can check yourself out in the morning before you go to work. And um, the scale, scale, a weight scale. This is where, of course, you can check your uh, weight. And uh, I'm not going to get on there. You're not going to see how much I weigh. i got to lose a little bit of weight. Um, so that gives you kind of a run through of some of the uh, words that are used in the bathroom. So next time, uh, you can impress your friends with all this knowledge of bathroom words and sentences. So uh, thanks for watching Learning This With Shane. Remember, subscribe to my channel and practice, 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 practice. That is the key, and you're going to be fluent in no time. Thanks. I'm out.